We want, to, we want you to listen carefully, Rico. Can we get everybody clapping, eh? I'm really grateful to be able to celebrate this very special day. And today does, it just marks that celebration that I, I think my son is ready. Rico, don't rush to get a girlfriend. Yeah. Tell them exactly what we're saying. Yeah. When a boy is born, his hair is not cut until a time when the family is ready. Usually it happens around five years old when, um, and it's a mark to as the child enters into schooling. I think it's become that tradition now. Um, but back in our days, back early in the early days, I think it was a mark when the child is released from its parent. I believe that predominantly for, especially here in Tokoroa, what I know, it's mainly Mangayan. It's a mainly Mangayan tradition. Um, but I believe Mangaya and Achu, possibly uh, Rarotonga, are the main islands that celebrate uh, hair cuttings. It's not, um, it's just very common amongst those islands. <laughs> I chose 12 years old today because I think that Rico now is at an age where he can choose for himself and so really the hair is a symbol of cutting his ties to me. Ever since I was born I've had it, I haven't chopped it off yet but soon it's going to be cut off. It symbolises from coming a boy to a man. Happy birthday Rico, you're gone from a boy to man. So when I had Rico, he, God really put me back um, on his path so that I could practice, I suppose, um, and learn how to be a, a good mother. And I'm so grateful for my family and helping me raise him. But that's the other thing about today is I didn't raise this boy alone. Uh, and at the haircutting celebration, you're going to see that uh, a lot of people, and I really want to uh, put out a special... Thank you to my Rico's godmother, Mona and uh, Bob, for their love of him. Even before he was born, they loved him and have been with me uh, right through raising, raising him. So I'm just overwhelmed and overjoyed and excited for today and just really happy for him because I think even at 12, I think I have a good son, and I think he's good because he's got Jesus in his life, and that's all I could ever ask. Children, I need you to sing along, okay? Wait, wait, pause. Okay, here we go, blow them out. Make it worse, son. Happy birthday to you. And I just pray that you will always have God in front of you, God beside you, God behind you. I'm gonna have to tell you, you'll only be my girlfriend, girl and friend.